off rap. I got four cars and they all black. Got four bras and they all that. We call that ballin'. Doing this is my calling. Flow is so appalling. My phone off and she calling. I'm like, yeah, what it do? Penthouse. Hi, everybody. It's Slab Train. Welcome back today, guys, to the channel for another vlog. Actually, we're going to be unboxing a few things today that I've received over the last couple of weeks. Starting off with this package from G2A, man. They hooked us up with a uh, special Christmas box. Now, unfortunately, I'm a little late opening this up. I do apologize for that, but um, this is going to be, I really don't even know what this is, man. If you look inside of this, there's a bunch of bubble wrap in here mixed in with a box. We do have a letter as well, too. And this is actually, it looks very fancy though. Holy shit. Okay, we can see the G2A sticking through there right now. Okay, so let's go ahead and open this up. Remember, this is a little bit late. I had this shipped to me. Uh, I got this right before around Christmas or so, but I just haven't had a chance to get these open in time. So here we go. G2A, what does it say? It says Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. And oh my God, look at the people on this. I don't know if this is even a card. So this really isn't even anything except for we got a bunch of people on this thing on the back. It says, may this wonderful time of year be filled with love and merit. May our good times together live long in the memory. May the seeds of our hard work bring only prosperity and bear the fruits of success in 2017. With much appreciation for your support and goodwill, we wish lots of festive cheer this coming holiday season. On behalf of people at G2A, CEO, thank you. Wow, appreciate that, a big load. Uh, I don't believe I am in this card because I didn't wear a hat, so uh, I didn't get the memo on to wear a Christmas hat. G2A, thank you very much for that Christmas card. This is why we're here though, man. This package right here. So let's go ahead and see what we're doing now. Don't mind the camera in terms of being able to see the tripod over here. It kind of bothered me. Holy sh what the hell is this, man? Look at that. Hold up. So this is what we're dealing with right now. And to be completely honest with you, this is really cool uh we have a wooden box let me just get this damn bubble wrap out of here son of a bitch there's no i don't see anything it's maybe oh whoa see i forget what these are damn called man what are these called again um oh, i'm trying to think of it in this damn thing i'm gonna remember as soon as this video is over i'm gonna be like what the, what the hell is this oh shit it's a little Okay, I see you. Kind of a block style calendar. I actually had one of these when I was a kid. Um, haven't really messed with these for a little bit here. Hold up. So it's like a block style uh, mixed in. Oh my God, look at this thing. This is absolutely sick. It's just a big calendar. It shows all the months of the year on there. That's really cool. Up next in our secret package, go ahead and pull out some. Oh, we got a mug. Yes, man, I love mugs. Oh my God. Thank you very much, G2A. We even have a little controller on there. That is super cool on that. And we have all the damn, look at this. Just dumping it all out, man. We got, we got socks, man. We have G2A socks. Never had these before. I may put them on. That's pretty cool. And what else do we have in here? We have nothing else, but I love this box. So I'm gonna be keeping this box. 10 out of 10, I will be keeping that. But let's see what is inside of this thing. Bag two from G2A, again. Perfect things, man. I love keeping these bags so I can put things in. Um, just really super nice. What the hell is this? G2A, okay. Intelligent puzzle. Solve G2A Christmas riddle. Detach one arm without any tools. I got this. So detach one arm without any tools. Attach one arm without any tools. This looks tough as shit, and I ain't down to do this right now. We're gonna put that away. That is it though from G2A. A little Christmas gifts, man. Big thank you from G2A. I mean, they didn't have to do this, and this is not the first time that they have done this for us. So just a huge thank you to G2A. If you guys don't know, they offer cheap and reliable games on their website. I've been promoting them now for quite some time. Um, I haven't had any issues with them, so it's just a great reputable site. Make sure you guys go check them out. Link will be in the description box down below with my discount code. Ladies and gentlemen, let's get to the next box. So our second package that we're gonna be opening up uh, is this guy here. This was ordered on Amazon. Very, very basic package, but I figured I would open it anyways. 
with you guys. And uh, I just really thought that this was necessary considering I'm gonna be using this camera a lot more. And uh, I picked up some new batteries. You guys can't see them. Picked up some new batteries for the Sony. And uh, j just like I said, there's nothing too crazy in here. Two battery packs, charger kit, right? The MPFD70 for the FDR 8X33. Picked that up on Amazon for like, I think it was like 30 bucks, man. I couldn't say no to it, I had to do it. Next up, this guy. Now I received this in a pack of two. I've already went ahead and equipped this to the rig and you guys would have seen this a long time ago. But Wheelstand Pro now offers a setup exactly like this so you can actually attach your keyboard to your rig without having an extra table. Now, I will be doing an unboxing video and installation video on this at a later time, but I just did want to show you guys how it looks in the package if you do end up ordering one. I will leave Wheelstand Pro's links down below for you guys to check out. but. Um, I really enjoyed this product. It's been sturdy. Haven't had any issues with this whatsoever. And uh, you know, once again, just another fantastic addition to the rig upstairs. So this, we're gonna be using for the second rig, man. The PlayStation rig, we're gonna throw that on. Last but not least, we have a package from Thrustmaster. So now this was actually a package that I was supposed to be going away for a trip on. And unfortunately, I just could not make the trip in time. Uh, just too many things going on in my life that I just, I had to decline the trip, unfortunately. However, Thrustmaster was super nice and they sent out the wheel that I was supposed to be going on the trip for. And unfortunately, you guys can tell my dog has been getting to the box, man. She's been ripping it and tearing it all over the place. I think right here as well too. Yeah, man, look at this. She loves cardboard. Look at you, girl. Yes, that, that is your mistake right there. Come on over here, miss. Don't be going through the tripod, girl. Go around the tripod. Around the tripod. No, you are not gonna fit underneath that tripod. Go around, are you? Finley, please don't be dumb on me. Finley, girl. No, hey. All right, guys, we're gonna go ahead and open this box up. Now, this is the Thrustmaster TSPC. Now, uh, this is a very high-end PC rig. Now, I'm very excited to open this box. I'm very excited to test this. Now, unfortunately, the test will not be on this video. However, though, it will be very, very soon uh, on the channel. Now, the reason for that is because this is a PC-only wheel, which means that um, I'm gonna have to take apart the complete rig and set this thing up. Or, I mount this on my desk and I run it kind of like a freestand wheel like I normally would if I didn't have a wheel stand pro. Because I don't want to have to take everything apart. So we'll see. All right, so the first glance at this box, it's a very sleek box. It says Thrustmaster TS PC Racer, the ultimate, the ultimate racing simulator for PC racers. So this is huge, actually. This is, I'm thinking this may go in my downstairs man cave. I'm not exactly too sure, but I would just love a rig where I don't have to worry about recording and I can just go downstairs and just run some laps, say on a Seto or live for speed or anything like that. But so we have a 40 watt motor that offers particularly dynamic and powerful effects and provides enhanced feedback. TSPC racer motor provides powerful 40 watt brushless force feedback and incredible velocity, dynamic torque, from long stall curves, stall mode, for super responsive zigzags, dynamic mode. Provides 50% more dynamics, four times greater stall force, and heat dissipation. Uh, so that should be interesting. We have the heart and FOC. So it says field-oriented control, heart, hall effect, accurate technology, provides 16-bit resolution. Now I'm not up on my resolution game, but I know it's a hell of a lot better than what we were working with. I'm pretty sure about that. Also too, uh, now it does say it's turbo powered, man. It says turbo power. It said it's external turbo power supply delivers constant power and massive peak power to instantly respond to ultra fast requests from the game rendered. So this is gonna be interesting. And it actually says the optimized efficiency versus heat at 86% with a finless design, peak power 400 watts. So Thrustmaster TSPC Racer, this looks very damn nice, and it does say compatible with the ecosystem. So we got the shifter, the pedals, and also the T3PA Pro add-on. So this is gonna be really cool just to see how this is going to feel, um, you know, compared to the TX racer that I have and the TMX racer that I also have. So bring this down over here, and let's see what we're gonna be dealing with, because this is gonna be a damn nice wheel, man. Starting us off, we're gonna go ahead and open this up, and uh, right away, we have the rim right here, first up off of the lid. Oh, geez, man, styrofoam be flying right now. 
Now this is a uh, very interesting wheel because it is an open wheel style. Now personally myself, I prefer a full rim, but this is compatible with the other rims as well too. So that is gonna be nice. And uh, looks like it's the same, yeah, it's the exact same system as all the other wheels are using. Um, this feels amazing though, holy shit, as well too. So that's really interesting. It's not that heavy, but uh, this is gonna feel very nice on our sim rig. It is underneath of that, and we're gonna pull this out to see what pedal system we're running. And look at that, they didn't, there is no pedals on here. There's no pedals. So that's something that I did not really expect uh, was that there was not gonna be any pedals on the rig. So that's a very unique setup here. This is a, holy shit. This is heavy as hell, man. Oh my God, this is no joke. This is literally a turbo, man. Oh my God, hold up. This is literally a turbo and it's heavy, man. This is actually a decent weighted uh, power brick here, but I love the style though, man. They put a turbo as their power brick. I love it. All right, so we finally got these things on the table. Uh, the wheel itself looks fantastic. It kind of has that kind of F1 GT3 style to it. I love it. I personally love it. Like I said, I wish it was a closed end rim. All right, so as it stands, I don't really see anything different from this wheel to the TX wheel that I have currently. However, though, the pins, if we have a quick look here, I'm trying to get this to zoom in. The pins actually look different than the other wheels. Actually, you know what? We gotta go test this shit out. Hold on, man, hold on. All right, so I just brought down the 599 rim. We're gonna have an up close look at these pins to see whether or not if it's the same or not. All right, so those are the pins on there. It looks like it's a six pin setup. And if we come on over here to the 599 rim, six pin. So now what that means is that this rim is actually gonna fit on here. We're gonna test this out right now just to confirm. And look at that. Oh yes, okay, so confirmed that this Thrustmaster TXPC will work with the 599. That's huge, that is absolutely huge. Very excited that it does fit. However though, I still love this rim and will very much be using it, but uh, that's gonna be real nice to use as well too, right? So it's a nice kind of change. If you're not liking this, you wanna drift a little bit, throw on the 599. We have kind of like a little air cooling system at the bottom right there. I do like that. Um, just very much, it, you know, everything looks very nice. Um, we have the TSPC racer on the bottom. Like I said though, the only downside to this is that it's only PC. But if you're looking for more of a sim experience though, and you only have a PC, this is the perfect rim for you. And if we go at the back of here of this wheel, um, very interesting setup as well too. For the first time, we have that 24 amp on the back of there. We also have a USB hookup. We have the shifter adapter and the pedals. Um, and then we have its own cooling system fan right there. So that's a very, very neat setup by Thrustmaster. Very excited to see this thing in action. And if you guys do wanna see this with a full on review, make sure you guys go ahead and slap that like button down below. Huge thank you to Thrustmaster though for making this unboxing possible. Like I said, I really wasn't even expecting to see this at the door and it just arrived. So just a huge thank you to the team behind there. And I'm just excited to give this thing a shot and you know see how it's gonna to compare to my TX wheel as well too. But ladies and gentlemen though, that's gonna pretty much do it for today's unboxing, man. We're done. We got a G2A sent us a beautiful care package for Christmas. We have my camera batteries and our beastly TSPC racer wheel. Ladies and gentlemen, let me know your thoughts of everything that you've seen down below. Ladies and gentlemen, that's gonna pretty much do it for today's episode here on the channel. Big thank you to Thrustmaster for coming through with a huge damn wheel, man. That thing's gonna be a beast. I'm very excited to check that thing out. Full links will be found in the description box down below if you guys wanna pick yourself up one. Wheel Stand Pro, huge thank you for the keyboard adapter as well too. I'm very excited to get that more used for live for speed, set of course and stuff like that on the PC. And as well too, G2A, for a little Christmas damn special delivery, man. Big thank you to everybody. Ladies and gentlemen, you guys follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, all which are found in the description box down below. Support us after I'm out.